Hey Simleys, welcome to part four of Let's Play The Sims 4 with Barbie, I guess. Uh, she's having a quick snoozle before she gets up and we're going to ask Ken to move in, which I'm pretty excited about because then we will have two Sims in the household, two Sims to look after their needs and um, yeah, that should be all good and well. So she's had a pretty good sleep in. Uh, let's quickly use a toilet and... Um, then we'll have some breakfast. Maybe we will... Yeah, we'll start cooking before we call Ken, actually. So let's go to our pink fridge. And maybe we'll just have a quick meal for now. We'll just have some... Maybe cereal today. Oh, God, I feel like cereal. Cereal would be good right now. For me, it's late at night. But who doesn't like cereal late at night? It's like having pizza first thing in the morning is the best thing ever. Cereal at night is the best thing ever. Oh, whose glasses are these? Ken. Typical, typical. And this one is Ken as well, so are we really sure we want to move in with you? Hmm? I, I do question that. I definitely do. Alright, let's pop those uh, into... Why is she going downstairs? Oh, she must be picking up more glasses from him. We could get a maid, although we don't really have that much luxury. So let's get Ken to come over. And then once he moves in, maybe he can help uh, clean up the house a little bit. All right. Good on you, Barbie. She's not too glamorous to do the dishes. That's a good thing. Oh, look at all the pretty birds going past. I haven't, I haven't noticed that in The Sims 4 yet. What a gorgeous view. I think she's about to get a bit stinky, but... Oh, well. Oh, well. There's our man. There he is. All right, let's invite inside. First things first. Um, and then maybe we'll invite him to stay permanently, which is really nice. And then they can get engaged and then get married and then have lots and lots of babies. Woohoo! <laughs> um, I also did say in the last part, oh, kiss straight away. I mean, propose straight away would be a bit keen. I did say in the other part, I have given her a makeover so she has more outfits. Um, there's a cause of that for those of you who were asking for it, but we will need to give Ken one as well. Let's take a picture together. And you know what? Let's give each other a hug. I also think we should go for a stroll to our little, our little garden over here where they can have the big moving in chat. I think that sounds pretty good. She's feeling a little bit tense. I would be feeling tense too if I was about to ask someone to move in with me. Uh, okay, nicely decorated. Why is she feeling tense though? Oh dear, good versus evil. This is why we're probably going to need to change her traits. We should put something a little less, um, like a little less full on. Maybe we can listen to romance. Can we listen to romance? Uh, there we go. Although we were sitting together. Okay, sit together. All right, that's better. How romantic. All right, let's have the big, the big chat. Make a move first, though. Oh, very pretty. <laughs> woohoo. Just straight up woohoo. I don't think so. Express fondness. And then, can we just ask to move in? Here we go. Maybe we should do something a little bit... Uh, something romantic. Maybe we can do a bit of a kiss before we ask to move in. Okay. Friendly. Ask to move in after the kiss. Oh wait, they're going to have to kiss after they ask to move in. Yay, moving in together. Click OK to go to household split or merge to modify which sims will live in which households. Okay, how exciting. Ken's going to be moving in with us. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, let's go to Ken's house. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. I feel like a few of you guys would have been like, <gasps> no. Um, we want to sell all lot furnishings. If all sims are transferred out of this household, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool! Okay, 
just double checking they are in Willow Creek. We are definitely uh, doing what we need to do. Hopefully they're still sitting on the chair together, but they might have been respawned somewhere else. That's all right. That's all right. At least they had the chat on the romantic chair. That's what we were wanting. Oh, exciting music. Oh, cute. All right. All right. All right. Oh, can't we, can't we kiss? Frenzied kiss. Angry? What? Why are you angry? Oh, dear. She will have to change her traits soon. Oh, well, she's happy again. Try to cheer up. Oh, so cute. This would be the perfect time pro to propose, but we, we will we'll propose a bit later. Aww. Cute. Alright, maybe we should hug. What other romantic things can we do before we head off to work? Try for baby straight away. They could try for a baby and then get married when she finds out she's pregnant. Mm, maybe we'll wait on that. And then a quick embrace. Oh, she does need to take care of a few things. Because uh, she wants to go to work feeling energized, I reckon we could sneak in the quickest shower. Take a brisk shower. Alright. In you go, Barbie. Make her feel just a little bit better. I thought brisk shower meant she's energized. Okay, good job. Alright, Ken, now you're here. Oh, he's already getting into her computer, seeing what she actually does for a living now that he lives here. She's off to work. What should, what should Ken do? Like, maybe he can start becoming a writer or a gardener or a collector or something. Hmm. Hmm, I think. <laughs> well, let's see what jobs are available in any case. Uh, find a job. See if anything looks like it might suit Ken. Although I do want him to be the stay-at-home dad. Um, that's something I would like. He could be a painter, a tech guru. Hmm. That could be cool. Writer. Writers can do well. Maybe he should write. Tech guru or writer. Although I haven't actually tried this one yet. Hmm. Although, if he just writes books, how about we just write books at home and then we don't actually have to go to work? Let's just practice writing. <laughs> write a genre book. Children's. <laughs> he can only write children's because he's not a very good writer yet. Oh, good night, night light. Alrighty, Ojo. Oh, Ken. But yeah, this house, actually, when they do have a baby, we need to figure out where they can go. Uh-oh, an old woman just scuffed Barbie's new work shoes. Oh my god, Barbie would lose her shoes. And they are the very finest quality fur gator. Should she teach the old lady a lesson or just let it slide? I swear we already had this. Uh, confront her. Barbie's not going to let that slide. All right. Barbie convinces the old woman to pay to have the shoes shined and rescaled. And now the other thugs know that nobody gets a free pass from Barbie. Mm-hmm. That's right. <laughs> That's right, Barbie has sass. Alright, he's getting that writing skill up. Good job, Ken. Then he can be a stay-at-home dad and he can write books whilst bringing up the children. Sounds so perfect. Alright, level two of the writing skill. Good job, we'll keep that up. Now, when when they do have kids, that's that's going to be the, the thing that I'm not sure what we're going to do. I guess we can build over the pool here. And this can be a bedroom. Um, yeah, and then this could also be another bedroom over here at one stage when we need to build up. One achievement, he finished writing an entire book. Woo! Oh, excuse me, Ken. Don't have a quick meal. We want you to cook, no, serve dinner for when Barbie gets back. Let's do a grilled cheese. He could also become really good at cooking as well. All right, let's cook this up. Ah, oh, he's the perfect man. And he knows it. <laughs> All right. So 
make that grilled cheese sandwich. Awesome, awesome. Barbie's home, so just in time for dinner. She's not super hungry, but we'll have a little bit just to... Just for the socialization, anyway. <laughs> I love her little giggle. Their first meal together in the new house. Ah, oh, cute. Let's put those walls up. Take a picture of their first meal together. Oh. Having a bit of a conversation. How about you um, express fondness while eating? And I feel like Barbie might like to have a little bit of gossip. No, Ken would gossip. Ken would be uh, the one peeking over the neighbor's fence. <laughs> um, oh, it's gone. It's gone. Oh, well. Oh, well, he can go to the loo. And then maybe they can have a sneaky woohoo before they go off to bed. Mm. All right, I think that's enough for you, Barbie. Let's clean that up. She doesn't want to clean it up? Come on. I'm not going to do it for you this time. <laughs> All right, use that toily girl. Did she... She didn't level up in her career, I guess, because we weren't in a good enough mood. We better watch that for next time, actually. Because really, we wanted to level up. Ken's just been hanging out in her office. No worries, Ken. Just watch us pee. <laughs> it's not rude or anything. Jesus. I mean, they seem pretty content with each other, though. All right. So, maybe. I mean, when's Barbie's day off? Oh my gosh, she actually doesn't have a day off because she works every single night. That's hardcore. No wonder she's so tired. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No. No, 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 no. We're not sleeping yet. Oh, I feel bad waking her up. She won't even wake up. Is he feeling flirty? Huh. Oh, yes, he is. Let's woohoo with Barbie then. Time for a little bit of woohoo. Woohoo! <laughs> she actually goes, woohoo! Okay, off they go. Oh, and she has her hair up, which is really cute. Break out the candles, make it romantic. Bobby Roberts and Ken Carter are woohooing for the first time. It's very good that they actually waited until they moved in together. That is cute. Well, Ken's uh, really awake. Bobby's going to go straight to sleep, no doubt, because she's been up the whole night. Ken's like, oh, I'm not that sleepy. <laughs> um, maybe we'll get him to do a little bit of writing while we uh, practice writing. Write a genre book. Genre book. Genre or genre? What do you guys say? Genre or genre? I thought this chair was for kids as well in The Sims 4. Never eat your pet turtle another. <laughs> Alrighty, Ken. Whatever you think. Whatever you think. He's like, yeah. <laughs> All right. You know what? I actually think that he should really get some sleep as well. Because maybe today is the day that he should propose. So then they can make lots and lots of babies. <laughs> Which I'm pretty excited about. Which is good. Because we've got to know each other. Then we've moved in together. And then we'll propose. So we're, we're, we're taking it part by part, which I think is a good thing. So they're not rushing into anything. Um, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. And I will speak to you soon. Bye.